Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. It's the same Tarot. So we're going to get into Gemini's reading today. I'm going to do Gemini's no contact read and see what we have for you. Okay, so if this does resonate here on the YT, go ahead and just give me a big thumbs up to support the channel, to support the videos, and everything about me should be in the description box. It's a beautiful day today and let's get started. All right, what's going on here, Holy Spirit, for gems? Or gems no contact the person that Gemini is thinking about the person that's thinking about Gemini it is such a wonderful day it's not too hot it's just not cold it's just beautiful I hope you guys are enjoying that energy Wow, so you have a lot of major arcana. So I'm just going to push back real quick. Okay. Um, you have a lot of major arcana here. I do see the Temperance energy, the King of Pentacles, the Page of Wands energy. I'm also seeing this uh, Six of Swords for you. I'm also seeing the Hyperont here and the King of Wands. Um, I'm definitely feeling like the angels are watching over this situation for you and this person and kind of like have some time apart, get it together, heal, do what you need to do, and then come back into the relationship. Now, the person that I'm picking up, Major Arcana, for those of you who resonate with this this could be a Sag this could be um, a Taurus energy this could be someone that you're married to for those of you or someone that you wanted to be married to someone that is quite old-fashioned or someone that is very stubborn as well I'm getting a lot of stubbornness I'm, I definitely am from the king of wands in reverse from the Taurus energy here within a high front is like making a decision and really setting their mind into what they believe in and like it doesn't even matter if people are trying to stop this first person from doing something or um, really sticking with something they're going to do it it. and I'm also seeing this Taurus this like earth energy in reverse so Capricorn Virgo Taurus energy that is definitely trying to avoid the matter and this person could even appear to be mean um, at times I just feel like this person knows that they have things to deal with within you gems and they're not doing that I'm also seeing like it's like time to give this time because there's no real plan at the moment or an idea or a new purpose or a new idea or what is it a new direction a new perspective like this person is not seeing things differently as yet so this is going to need time divine time and is at you know the the first the front the, the <laughs> at the front line here with this situation okay so this is what i'm seeing here and the stubbornness within this person and this is like making it very difficult to deal with this person it's like talking to a brick wall you know i just feel like this person could make you feel like they're not willing or wanting to for something to work here um i'm also seeing like moving on and letting this thing happen like moving on with your life or accepting this transition for what it is because it was many trials and tribulations here as well within this situation I feel like you you feel like you're by yourself within this um, element um, but there's just a lot that you have learned as well and you don't want to give that away you don't want to give that away I don't feel like you do I feel like there is Sag energy for those of you um, I'm also seeing Aquarius energy a lot of you might feel like by walking away from this like there is no hope like this is hopeless Hmm. This person might be different from you. I, I feel like this person might have different beliefs than you when it comes to the relationship. This could be about religion or just faith wise. Okay. Um, I feel like this person might be from another, yeah, another country for some of you. I'm just seeing like this person has a whole different community. And this person tends to i'm just seeing following someone here it's like they're appearing to have like control of something but at the same time it's like they're giving me sag energy here 
being really, you know, impulsive or hasty, reckless at times. Again, tell me more, Holy Spirit. I'm trying to really take time with my shuffling because I'm on the deck, you guys, and I don't want cards to fall down. I'm also seeing the Five of Swords here. The Empress. Virgo energy for those of you who are dealing with a Virgo. Major Arcana. Oh, wow. You have the Queen of Swords. You also have the Nine. And you have the Five of Cups. So, you know, you just had a place mentally. Or uh, I should say not mentally, emotionally. Well, mentally as well. To kind of like move on from this and kind of like take what this is and accept this for what it is and move on with your life because i'm seeing the five of cups like you tried and you don't have anything else to try um and you're accepting that you know you're accepting the situation you want to just move on and forgive um there was a lot of stress behind this there was a lot of confusion behind this i'm also seeing depression a lot of you are having a hard time taking care of yourself here and i feel like you just wanted to communicate and you wanted to get this under wraps and you wanted to find out with this energy that is coming in or trying to come in back into your life you know like what can i do you know can we fix this and this person was making it very hard for you emotionally and i'm seeing like you had no choice but to walk away like this person just gave you that choice like to walk away there is like it wasn't like this person was trying to fix this and then they have an in it to win it kind of energy and this is in the the present moment for a lot of you so it's like i'm just seeing the transition and you're grateful for this because it's like some of you dodged a bullet. This is what I'm getting. Some of you really dodged a bullet here. Hmm. And I'm also seeing that Virgo energy is so strong with the, the Empress. And I'm seeing like this person been away for quite a while. But something didn't work out here with this person's energy for what they were trying to do. I feel like they're just like, they're looking back as well. Wondering if this is, this is something that they could have avoided, this obstacle. Because they really wanted this to be a long-term situation with you, but I'm just seeing like it, it didn't end up that way. I'm also seeing the three of pentacles here as well. I'm also seeing the death and the nine of wands energy. So Scorpio energy is coming out here for those of you who are with a Scorpio. I'm also seeing Pisces with the moon within the eight of cups and the hangman and, ooh, and the king of cups in reverse Pisces energy here. So there's a lot of pride. There's a lot of pride here. There's a lot of, you know, disappearance. Like this person disappeared. So some of you are trying to find out where this person is or what's the next move with the relationship. This person disappeared on you. I'm just getting like this thing, this nine here. You know, this nine is in the present as well. Like the, the, the depression, the anxiety, the stress the, the second guessing yourself within this relationship i just feel like despite making a decision for yourself of moving on and accepting what is going on here you still want to work this out even though you're moving on it's like i'm getting energy of like you know learning from whatever you have learned here within the swords the experience and accepting it for what it is and just moving on within this energy of the death within the number 13 very excited for this new start but at the same time i'm just seeing like bittersweet kind of energy within this person it's like you're just accepting it not that this is what you want and i kept i keep saying that over and over and over again because i don't know i just feel like the holy spirit want me to there's an unfinished business. I feel like you still have to learn from each other with this three here. Like I'm just getting an energy like you still have to learn from each other here. But this person is just not making it easy for you because they're not around within this 
no contact energy hmm even with the eight of cups i'm just seeing like this person really thought this was the best thing but they truly have a lot of love for you the person that i'm picking up within this read okay it's like they had a real opportunity to make this something within the four but they missed this opportunity and it was supposed to be a lesson a lesson for you and this person to kind of like grow together it was important here to work together to have some kind of fulfillment as well with each other and celebration maybe engagement um but it's a learning process and then i'm seeing the four the missed opportunity and then i'm seeing the nine here so they still even think of you as the wish fulfillment like that person that they want to be with and i'm also seeing this eight so there's going to be message coming in this is not over yet this is not over yet tell me more i'm seeing the sun here so leo energy for those of you who are with a leo i'm also seeing the six of pentacles and the four of pentacles and the sun wow beautiful energy they think of you as that sun energy but there is some kind of selfishness selfishness here some kind of greed with this person is like i'm just getting like they wanted everything or they wanted more from this connection more than what you could have gave them or nothing was quite enough within the relationship with you they didn't give you that satisfaction that you you know you are everything that they truly needed because it's true you are everything that they truly needed and they made you feel otherwise here <sighs> wow i feel like there is going to be clarity because i'm seeing the holy spirit bringing back some kind of clarity between you and this person within this energy the six of pentacles but i feel like this person wanted more than what they can true it's like you're trying to constantly make some kind of balance within this relationship but this person is taken a lot because this is someone that kind of like guide themselves away from you or they feel like they have to protect themselves away from you and this is like giving me an energy like this person doesn't really trust you hmm you have the strength in the back of the deck so i'm getting leo twice over as well along with pisces for those of you virgo taurus aquarius energy this could be their moon aquarius could be their moon or their rising but angel michael is on the back here this is the future element you know your sun is looking good in the present moment so you're still this youthful bubbly energy that they're so attracted to but i'm also seeing like this energy here within this within this the strength in reverse it's all about your future like you're worried about this like did you miss an opportunity within that ten of cups energy and a lot of you really wanted to be married but i feel like a lot of you are losing whatever you put a lot of work in as well but i'm seeing like in the future this person is constantly trying to resolve some kind of conflict with you that they have been avoiding within the king of pentacles thank you holy spirit okay it's like they're really focused on this goal so this is important to them and i'm also seeing the nine here so a lot of you really need to focus on yourself because you have lost yourself within the future element. You have lost your identity, okay? Remember, your son is very important. You are a smiler, okay? You're not supposed to be as serious as you are today. And I feel like it's because everything that you have been experiencing and this person, I'm just seeing gossip, okay, with this person. Like this person is making promises that you're still waiting for, like they're undelivered like you, they're not delivered to you it's all talk no show here okay within this person a lot of you could be like blocking this energy because of you just feel like it's just not going to go anywhere but here's a contract so yes i'm seeing this person in your future okay um so this is what i have for you for the no contact read it's not going to be too long today because i have 
I want to do a lot of readings today. I just feel like I need to like be of service. So um, I hope this resonates. All the information for me will be in the description box. Remember to thumbs up your video to show support and love and to help the channel to grow. And yeah, I will see you guys in your next one. Bye guys.